8 nhóm bệnh nhân bác sĩ nào cũng từng gặp. 1. Nhóm bệnh nhân thích chia sẻ. Hi Crystal, very nice to see you again today. How are you feeling? Mm -hmm. How's school? So you know, yesterday I was walking to school and then on my way to school, I saw this guy and he was talking with this lady and they have a dog and they walk together and they was, you know, they started to argue and I was trying to listen to what they were saying and then I trip over this rock and then I fall down. Nhóm bệnh nhân hờ hững. I feel okay. Sure. Yeah, that's fine. Nhóm có 7, 7, 4, 9 bệnh. How can I help you today? Hi doctor, so good to see you today. I have a lot of questions for you today. Now, I think my head hurt, my throat also hurt, my chest hurt, and I think I broke my foot too. Nhóm không có câu hỏi gì. I don't have any question today. I just come for a checkup. Nhóm sao cũng được. So for your situation, I have a few thoughts. And I want to hear your thoughts and your concern about this. Um, I don't know. Whatever you want to give me, that's fine. Um, I just want the symptoms to go away. I don't know. You're the doctor. You do whatever you want. Just give me the best treatment. Nhóm tự khám, tự chữa bệnh. How are you feeling? So I'm pretty sure I have a sinus infection and you know I look up on the internet and I think that I need an antibiotic. You know this feel like a sinus infection so you should definitely give me an antibiotic. Nhóm muốn được giúp nhưng gì cũng không chịu. Yes doctor, I'm very sad. I don't know what else to do. <sighs> yes, that's very terrible. Not being able to do anything, that's really really terrible. You know, I feel really, really depressed, and I just want to get some help. <laughs> I don't know what to do. You know, nothing helped. I'm so sorry to hear that. You know, in your situation, uh, sometimes counseling can help. Also, if you are interested in medication, we can also offer medication for you. Most people have benefits if they do a combination of counseling and medication. No, I haven't taken medication. But I don't think it's gonna help. I haven't tried counseling. No, but I don't think it helped either. I'm really sad. You gotta do something to help me. <laughs> what can I do? Help me. Nhóm nghe tư vấn xong không chọn cái nào. So for colon cancer screening, we have two options. Number one is Cologar, which is a stool test that you can submit your stool. And with this one, uh, you can repeat after three years if the result is normal. And option number two is colonoscopy, which is the traditional way and the gold standard way to do colon cancer screening. Now, if this one is normal, then you will repeat in 10 years. Which one would you like to choose? Neither. Còn gì nữa đâu mà khóc với sao?